Welcome back to one of these videos where we fill you in on all the things we've done during August where we couldn't really make a vlog about. First off, we went to St. Peter's and we camped at Battery Provincial Park, where we made a vertical video for Woods on Instagram. We had the best sunset at the lighthouse, and then we had the most amazing sunrise at Point La Chaude Beach. Then after shooting that video, we attempted to explore the Shuby Canal. Gonna be bombing around Dartmouth and other areas today. Just gonna do whatever. <laughs> do whatever. Yeah, it's a whatever video. Uh, it's, a whatever it's not a whatever. We are at Shuby Park. We're gonna see if we can take these doggos kayaking with us. Oh yes. Do they get life jackets? They're in the they're in the mail. Yeah, we're getting the life jacket. <laughs> Toby's so confused. Indy's a pro. Indy's so good, she just hopped right in. I know, she wanted to jump in mine. This is the best. Fifteen bucks for the hour. Choo choo Toby! What is that? Cookies. No Indy. <laughs> <laughs> and he was gonna go for them. Uh oh. Oh, we're trapping them. <laughs> Toby almost bailed after a squirrel. Oh, back there. Back there. She just wanted to get to you guys. It was so cute, but also like very destructive. We've discovered the key to Toby is comfort. I should have put a blanket on the bottom of this kayak and she might have enjoyed it a lot more. That was fun. So fun, I had to change shirts. Come on. <laughs> you had to lie down. You have to be comfortable before you have a drink. Oh, mom, this girl, I know. This is lock number five of the Shuby Canal. What would you like to eat, ma'am? Just some cold stream drinks? Yeah. Bleh. We pass this cold stream place all the time. Never been in, so we're gonna go check it out. Let's hope they can feed us. We missed happy hour. Happy? Very happy. This is exciting. So we got Georgia the Jungle plan. Gravity Luxury Domes. It's right on the Shuvanakini Canal River. It's beautiful. It's yeah, you can see like, the water right there. Feels like it's just like one of those larger domes. And it's got like a closed in ceiling bathroom. And the skylight up there. How do you get it open? Yeah, I don't know. Nice. Full kitchen? Full kitchen part? I don't know. Unfortunately, not dog friendly, so I will be sleeping in the car with the dogs. Yay. Dinner of champions. Big ol' sub and a bunch of cider and beer. Oh, I think the tile bar is about to come in, actually. Skylar wasn't joking, the tile bar is happening right now. There's rafters out right now in this rain. You can just see them right there, I hope. Skylar's getting a video. It is raining so much that the door started leaking. Checked out of Gravity Domes. I think we're gonna go back there and just get some drone footage because it rained the entire time we were there. Any pocket when it would stop raining, we were like, oh, And then it just started up again. And then it would start again like two, <laughs> two seconds later. And it was like downpouring. Last night we were watching a show and we couldn't hear the show over the rain. But it was so lovely, like it was mm -hmm. really, really nice. And it was really well temperatured too. They have like a little heat pump in there and I don't know, I had a very comfortable sleep. Yeah, it was good. Now we're in Maitland. We're gonna get some something to eat at Freeze and Roy's. Freeze and Roy's, Canada's oldest general store. And the Mudside Cafe. That's where you eat. Club sandwich. 
It's a honeycomb. It's a fresh honeycomb that was just brought in. We've never had honeycomb. Yeah. <laughs> Do we just eat the whole thing? I think so. We just like bite. sniffed it. <laughs> well, it smells like honey. That's so good. That is so sweet. And then it gets like a little bit like chewy, and then a little bit more bitter at the end. That's but it's chewy. like a nice. Letting the dogs run around. We're at the a park just up the road from Friesen Rice. It's really nice. There's a little gazebo there that has a picnic table in it. A little store. I think it's just gonna rain like this all day. What's up, Toby? What's up, dude? Hey, Indy, you gonna stop drinking that? Check out this place called Sweet Spot Chocolate Shop. They won't give away their secret exactly, but it is it's, uh, like what? Well. Here we got some goodies from this cool chocolate shop. Got a happy birthday one for my mom. It's a total hidden gem. It's a mint patty. Mint patty. You make creams. Icy square mints. They hope. There you go. Thanks. Oh, that's so nice. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not good at making like. Is that good? Yeah. We just like abandoned yesterday because it just kept raining. So we went home, did some work, and we're starting over. We're heading out again to do the whole Shuby Canal area. This is lock number six of the Shuby Canal. It's a nice spot. There's people walking their dogs. Dags. Dags. We're gonna try to see if we can eat at this place. It's called Batars. Uh, but the parking lot is really busy. Doggo friendly. Pretty extensive menu there. Mediterranean roasted haddock sounds good. I think yours looks very pretty. Yours does too, though. Look. Nice shawarma. Yours was haddock, was it? Toby's feeling extra uncomfortable right now. <laughs> Oh my god! Your lunch was good? It's like a nice creamy sauce with my chicken. With my fish. Damn it. Lunch was great. New favorite spot just outside of the city to stop at instead of going to the big stop. Like the guy who donated this yeah. stuff? Oh, the guy that donated this stuff feels like over a hundred. He died in like 2015. It's actually really cool in that museum. Way bigger than I expected. Lots of cool stuff to look at. So that was us exploring the Shuby Canal. Now we're back in Cape Breton, where we had to shoot some photos for PetSmart. We got the paddleboard out and Toby was not a fan. Like, really not a fan. She gets really uncomfortable. Eventually, Skylar managed to get both dogs on the paddleboard, which was pretty cool. The photos turned out pretty good. And then we went to Halifax where we spent three days with this beautiful couple that we've never met, Adrian and Lilia, and their beautiful dog Haven. Downtown Halifax has a lot of unique public art which we checked out, and we also ran into an old friend of mine at the Prince George where we were staying. We'll do a wide angle shot of this like this, like they're greeting them and passing them in the back, and then we'll also do a shot from the dog's perspective looking up at you guys. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> right, let's go. And then we ate at the waterfront in the rain. It's not like a game that came in the rain. <laughs> Is your back getting wet? Okay. <laughs> Let's move it over no, to the side. No, yeah, but you're in models. models. You can't be wet. Oh, wow. <laughs> this is hilarious. I'm, I'm, I'm getting soaked right here. I don't think it's really gonna. That's where you're ever had. That's really good. <laughs> we also checked out a bunch of parks. 
had some really tasty beers at Garrison Brewery, had ice cream in multiple places. We are toast. Been running around Halifax shooting all day. Totally exhausted. We were totally exhausted from the shoot, and I had to run every night to prepare for the East Coast Trail. We ate at the new Cable Wharf restaurant, where I got some delicious fish and chips. And then the next morning, we got this amazing sunrise at Citadel Hill. We had some lunch at the Brown Hound Public House. The nachos were super good. And then we said goodbye to this lovely couple and their beautiful dog. And then right back to Cape Breton, where we did a photo shoot with tiny houses. They have five rentals, and each one was very unique. They were really cool. Exciting. Metal. Is it? Oh. And then right after that, we spent our entire weekend at Blueberry Jam, where we did photo video for them. And then I left for Newfoundland to do the East Coast Trail. David is actually gone for the next week and a half. He is on a journey, an expedition in Newfoundland to fast pack the East Coast Trail. I'm sure he will have a magnificent video from that trip, uh, which leaves me and the girls alone. It's the first time we've actually been apart for more than about two or three days since we met almost eight years ago. And I think I'll just make a mini vlog of everything I get up to in the next week and a half. He's also left me without the wide lens, so instead of using this camera and having it real close to my face, I'll probably be shooting a lot of this video on my phone. This is my mom. <laughs> it's a video. <laughs> Speller thought she was going to vlog her week, but spent a bunch of time with family and friends, so here's a few clips from that instead. She spent a day with her mom sightseeing, ate at Labrie, and tried some wedding dresses on in Marguerite. <laughs> then she took the ferry to PEI to be reunited with old friends. Be free! <laughs> Apparently Skylar also went out partying in this wig. Followed by more friend time, camping, live music, and a boat trip around Sober Island. <laughs> well, we dance in the rest. How you doing, boo-boo? Belly rubs. That's one, too. Right oh up by the toes. God. Yeah, so right up by the toes, toes, too. Even the big toe here. There's a blister on there, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. just do that. <laughs> I started, I started my toes like this to relieve the pressure off of the, it just caused me blisters. Thanks for watching. I'll be working on that East Coast Trail video and it's coming out soon. Mm -hmm.